Hi, I'm Chelsea Jansen with the Fantasy Hot Corner here with our fantasy expert, John Stenko. John, let's get right into it. Baseball season's right around the corner, and the Seattle Mariners made a big splash in headlines when they signed Robinson Cano. Yeah, Robinson Cano, former All-Star for the New York Yankees, now on the West Coast. How will he fare fantasy-wise? Listen, he hits 313 on the road for his career, which is actually above his career average. So very good on the road hitter. So no problems in safe school field. The question is, will he have the cushion in the lineup that he had with the New York Yankees? Newcomer Corey Hart is going to the Mariners. He missed all of last season, but his three seasons before, go, before going on injury, he had 20 home runs each of those three seasons. Yeah. Also, Logan Morrison coming from the Florida Marlins. He's been banged up with a knee injury the past couple of years. Will he be able to help the Mariners lineup as well? Because they need offense. They only hit 237 as a team last year, ranked 28th in the major leagues. Robinson Cano will help, and he will still be a top five fantasy second baseman. Okay, John, the Yankees lost Cano, but they brought in catcher Brian McCann to fill the void. Yeah, fantastic move by the New York Yankees. Five-year, $85 million deal to improve a position they drastically did need to improve. Only eight combined home runs between Austin Romine, Francisco Cervelli, and Chris Stewart last year for the New York Yankees. Brian McCann, mark my words, will have over 30 home runs at the New Yankee Stadium and will have over 90 RBIs. Speaking of power lefties, Prince Fielder was shipped from Detroit to Texas after his career low in home runs last year. Yeah, only 25 home runs for Prince Fielder last year. Also had a career low in slugging percentage as well. Now he moves to Texas where he will bat third in the lineup for the first time in his career. He batted fourth in Milwaukee behind Ryan Braun. And he batted fourth in Detroit behind the best hitter in baseball, Miguel Cabrera. Now how will he fare in that third spot? His RBIs will probably dip a little bit, but he still has good protection behind him in Adrian Beltre. I expect a bounce back year, especially with that jet stream in right field at Arlington Stadium. That's it for this edition of the Fantasy Hot Corner. I'm Chelsea Jansen with John Stanko. Follow John on Twitter at jstanko99.